probably going to be a useless video for most, but this is uh, being showcased on the Series X. I just wanted to show you now that the game is fully released, what it looks like from the main menu, browsing through the options, and that's pretty much it. For the most part, everything is the same. There's been a few changes naturally. So from here, we can select map. This is different. As far as I know, because I don't know a lot about the game, this is all one map. And I could have sworn I had read something about San Francisco being out on day one. However, I don't happen to see that. Maybe there's something I'm missing. Maybe I misread. That is not the point. I just wanted to quickly go through all of this here so that you can see this. Definitely a little bit different than when it was in uh, early access. We can go ahead and go to the apartment just to see if anything has changed. Everything seems to be roughly the same. I've already done a video on uh, the skateboard customization. That's to select your station, customize your skaters. The same, I've already gone through this as well, where you can pick up to 18 different skaters. I've already made a separate video on that. All right, let's take a look at... Oh, I have to go out in order to view all the options. Unless I go to the laptop, I just don't like going to it that way. It's my OCD. Yeah, so we can select our map and then we've got skater logs, mission, challenges, tutorial, replay editor, the skate guide, the experimental stuff we still have these options available to us i think at one point there was give me my stuff and you can have all the grip tape and everything unlocked that's not there city life settings pedestrians on and off the density under experimental the credits nobody cares about that uh, let's go to options we've got gameplay camera audio display day night language under gameplay i don't want to mess with that we have easy well, we have assisted, easy, default, and hardcore. I'm leaving mine on custom. Input mode, mode. Wow. Input mode. Left foot, right foot for analog sticks or front and back foot. I've already made a separate video on that. There's no legacy mode anymore. Body rotation mode is still there. Your board settings, right? Flip trick settings. I haven't touched any of these. Grind settings all seem to be the same. Revert settings. Bail auto respawn. Big drop landing input. Wear and tear settings. Then your advanced settings. All the stuff that we wish we had in Skater XL. Everything seems to be there. There doesn't seem to be, like I said, too many changes about from legacy mode being gone. 60 FPS in graphics mode, 120 in performance. Again, separate video on that. Apart from that, I don't see any other changes. Everything's the same. You can center your skater, offset it. All that kind of stuff. The camera lens, all the different features for that. The camera models, camera filters. Camera light, which I like when you're in a dark area and you have it on. It just keeps your skater illuminated a little better. Like kind of having a flashlight. I have it on streamer mode, which means basically you get no music whatsoever. And then display. This is where you can trick display. Go to video, graphics, again, performance, like I was just talking about. Your brightness is in here as well. Your day-night cycle is still there. Your time of day, hell, the sun angle, whether or not you want to simulate the clouds and how much cloud coverage there is. Language, English, Francais, Italiano, Deutsch, Espanol, eh? Et Polski. Uh, exactly. It's Russian, but, you know, no one cares about that. Um, Portugues, Brasileiro. Lianaya. No? Okay, that's not working out. I Oh, that one is uh, Korean. And, uh, okay, that was really cringy. Okay, so never mind that. I think that's pretty much it. 
again, I just wanted to make a quick, you know, thing of a thing here. Uh huh. I can skate down the stairs, but I can't do a simple grind. There you go. I'm taking a nap. As always, if you liked the video, I mean, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. It does greatly help support the channel with the algorithm. If you didn't like the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs down. And as always, I'll bend it in half and twist it. Mm-hmm. And if you want to subscribe to the channel... Oh! Leave it on a high note! Obviously, that would be great, but if not, thanks for stopping by anyways. Take care, and maybe I'll see some of you in the next video. Bye for now.